Hi everyone, I'm Trevor Grieco with Medical Metrics, and today I'm going to show you how to use SpineCamp from your PACS. SpineCamp is a fully automated x-ray analysis software. It's been designed to inject quantitative reports and enhanced visualizations directly into the clinical workflow. This software does not require any new interfaces. The results can be viewed in your native system um, with the standard DICOM viewer. I'll show you exactly how that works. I have a demo PAX environment here. It's been preloaded with a number of demo patients. And we'll just work with this first patient here. It's um, a lumbar spine four view x-ray study. And to send this to spine camp, you will simply select the patient and use your DICOM send tool to send to spine camp. It's that simple. At this point, these x-rays are being sent to a fully automated analysis pipeline that will identify the x-rays, label all the imaging, um, and calculate and report on a number of different results, including spinal motion and spinal alignment. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the data. We just open this up in our standard DICOM viewer, just like we would with our native imaging. You can see all the imaging here. We have an AP, we have a lateral, uh, we have a flexion image, and an extension image. And I'll go ahead and set up a little side-by-side -side layout just for standard viewing of flexion extension. Yeah, this might be how we typically look at it. We have extension on one side, flexion on the other. We see this patient has spondylolisthesis at L4, L5. We might be asking ourselves if this is mobile. Um, traditionally, we might use line drawings and uh, take measurements, but with spine cam, there's no need to do that. You can see that we've delivered back quantitative reports in what we call stabilized series. So I'll pull in that data right now, pull in the uh, L5 stabilized series, since it's the level of interest with the spondylolisthesis, and I'll pull in the flexion extension report here. Now I'll walk you through what we're looking at. So what we have here on the left is what we call a stabilized series. And what that means is that a vertebral body, L5 in this case, has been registered between flexion and extension. You can see me toggling back and forth. This is a simple flick of the mouse wheel going between flexion and extension. You can very clearly see the motion that is occurring at L4, L5. Everything is properly labeled for analysis transparency and explainability. All the calculations that you're seeing over here on the right are derived directly from these landmarks and the registration that you're seeing at L5. L5 is what we call stabilized. It is held frozen in place between flexion extension. It provides a reference point to clearly visualize the motion at the level above and below the stabilized body. You can see that we actually report on motion at every single level and we stabilize all the bodies. So we could pull in an L4 stabilized series, look at the quality of motion above and below L4. You can see the motion at L3, L4 right there, as well as the motion at L4, L5 very clearly. And again, it is all quantified over here, angular motion, translational motion in percent, as well as in millimeters. These are customizable metrics and the uh, our objective, reliable, um, fully automated and available at the click of a button. Aside from the flexion extension analysis, SpineCamp will also analyze the neutral lateral imaging and provide you with a report um, on the segmental alignment, including disc angle, disc height, spondylolisthesis. We can provide spinal pelvic parameters. And you can see that we annotate the neutral lateral, lateral image just like we annotate the flexion extension image. All vertebral bodies are labeled. The corners are specified. The femoral heads are identified. We actually um, specify the midpoint between the femoral head centers with this cross-hatched landmark. And all that information is used in the calculations that are reported right here for your visibility. So you can get all these measures on the fly um, whether they're segmental alignment parameters or the spinal pelvic parameters, pelvic incidence, pelvic tilt, the mismatch, all available at the click of a button with SpineCamp. So thank you very much for taking the time to 
learn about how to use SpineCamp from your packs. Looking forward to making this technology available to you.